you go back several decades and compare it to what we have today, the banking industry has changed tremendously. You have the ability with online banking and smartphones to do almost everything on your own time and at your, uh, your own convenience. We've also seen a significant number of regulations affecting the banking industry going back over the last 25 years or so. A lot of it in response to crises, but as a result of that, the industry is better capitalized and has greater liquidity and is uh, better at risk management practices than it ever was. So in my role as Chief Financial Officer, obviously I do a lot of the financial planning for the company, but as Corporate Secretary, I've also been able to work with management and our board to put uh, strengthen our internal controls, uh, improve oversight of executive compensation, improve transparency of reporting to shareholders. So that really has helped the company uh, in the long run. You really can't run a business like this without great financial information. Uh, and David has really provided that to us over a long period of time. In addition to that, he is very strategic, which is a little bit unusual for a CFO. Uh, so he not only provides good information, but he really gives us a lot of good ideas. David's really a multi-talented banker. He really brings financial expertise uh, and really a feeling for his fellow colleagues that I think is different than a lot of executives that I've been around over time. Uh, he really is the full package. What I've come to realize is that while obviously in banking you need to have good products and services and nice branches and the right technology, what really matters is people. And I'm so blessed to be able to work with wonderful colleagues at Washington Trust. And it really is uh, good people that make good things happen.